powers of 10. If we write 1 followed by a 0 or multiple zeros, then the resulting number is called a power of 10. You are familiar with these numbers already. For example, 10, 100, 1000, and so on are all powers of 10. Another way to describe a power of 10 is to say that it is the value we get when we multiply 10 by itself a number of times. So 10 is actually 10 to the power 1. And 100 is 10 to the power 2, or 10 times 10, which is 10 multiplied by itself 2 times. And 1,000 is 10 to the power 3, which is 10 multiplied by itself 3 times. Instead of writing 1 followed by so many zeros, there is a short way to express these values. We can use an exponent, which is just a small number that we write on the top right of the last digit in a number, like this. Notice that the power equals to the number of zeros on the right of 1, and also equals to the number of times we multiplied 10 by itself. For example, 10 to the power 4 could be written like this and it's equal to 10 multiplied by itself four times, which is 1 followed by four zeros. The following table shows the powers of 10 up to a value of 1 million. The second row shows the values written as an exponent of 10. As you can see, the number in the exponent is equal to the number of zeros on the right of 1. Finally, notice how every power of 10 is 10 times larger than the power that comes before it. For example, multiplying 10 to the power 2 or 100 by 10 will give us 1000, which is 10 to the power 3, also 10 to the power 5, or 100,000 multiplied by 10 will give us 1 million, or 10 to the power 6. In this lesson, you learned how to represent powers of 10 using exponents.